Hey guys, what's going on? It's Grant from Grant and Shelby here today with a very unique looking muscle box. Uh, this is the muscle box for November. I'm very excited to open this up. Muscle box is a fitness subscription box. It costs roughly around 28 to 30 ish dollars, depending on shipping where you're at. Again, heard up to $40, so depends on where you're located, but these guys do a wide variety of fitness related type of stuff where they give you they give you workout plans. They've given they've given me like equipment before, bags, a lot of different things. And typically whenever they do something a little bit more unique than what their normal box is, which is like a black box, there's something really, really good in here. So I'm very excited to open this up and try to see if it's worth the $28 um, and so on and so forth. So let's get into it. Oh boy, okay, there's a couple of uh, good things in here. Let's go ahead and start off with the cookies and cream protein cups. I believe this was in the last one, if I'm not mistaken. So um, I honestly did not try them, but probably will be trying them now just because uh, I have so much. Then we've got Next Bar Protein, a banana nut bread. That sounds pretty good. Uh, 15 grams of protein for this bar. So just good real quick meal supplements. And then one of my favorite flavors from Rain. Very excited for this because since I've been needing some energy for today, we've got um, the Lili Koi Lychee. I think that's how you say it, but uh, it's one of their newer flavors. Really good energy drinks um, with their tasting and things like that because, I mean, they are backed by Coke, but, you know, they don't really say that. But anyway, oh, love these. Looks like we've got Hyperwear compression socks. Some of my favorites. I like these for lifting and then also just whenever I'm running errands, whenever I'm doing other stuff. Um, they're really nice compression socks. They stretch, so um, big fan of these these um, type of socks. You know, they are are a little bit more stiff compared to um, other compression socks. So like, there are a couple of others like New Balance compression socks I like. Um, Under Armour does an okay job, but um, these are definitely within like my top three of like really good weightlifting socks. So then it looks like a three month winter shredder, really relevant during, you know, this whole winter. So I'm liking that a lot. They have a lot of cardio sessions. Um, they tell you like which type of days to go on and off. But again, we keep on going back to these Actually, they're, they're a little bit better, but um, not really good, uh, you know, Photoshop type of stuff. So, but you know, it's still pretty decent. Then it looks like I got a FitBod 30 days challenge. Um, you know, you actually get, uh, get um, subscription for FitBod. So um, cool there. I've heard of FitBod before. Um, I've heard they're a pretty good, um, fitness subscription, but again, I've never tried them, so might be doing a 30-day challenge just to see if uh, that works or not. Of course, when they're in a different box like this, it seems like it's always a bag. You're always getting bags. This is the, including the drawstring bag that I just recently got. I believe this is number five overall. And uh, it's from Hyperwear. Looks a little bit different compared to my other bag that I normally wear. I do like the dark blue. It's a smaller bag, just like my gray one that I typically bring to the gym, but like, again, this is another bag. Like that's, that's a lot. That's a lot within the past. Now granted, I, I, I've had these guys for two years, almost three years, but that's still a pretty good amount of bags that I'm just, I just don't need. Okay, so looks like there's a pocket right here. I'm assuming for like any sort of shoes or for any sort of belt that you want. The only thing though is that it does go through. So like you're just gonna be limited with space for here. Um, that's something I've not really been a huge fan of, but it looks a little bit different compared to my gray bag. Um, I do really like the dark blue. The dark blue is really, really something I do like the color of, but I mean, other than that though, it's the exact same. And I got that bag again, I believe in January of 2018 or even 2019. So really like, I think I got it in January, 2019. And that was like, 
That was awesome, I'm still using them. I, I don't need this many. There's so many, so many. So that's it for the box. Again, five items, right? You get your socks, you got a bag, and then you have an energy drink, and then some snacks. Um, it seems like this is just their routine type of thing. It's fine. Um, it's easy to make a bag. It's it's easy to make a box that way. I would say that right now they're sitting at like a solid C. Um, but we're gonna go over the pricing to see if it's gonna be higher or lower than my expectation. I did want to note that uh, they did not talk about the bag on here. Um, honestly, like the bag that I use, it's really probably it's probably worth like a $25 bag um, I think that that's a fair price for, for for that type of bag it's lasted me almost like it's lasted me about two years already so for a bag to come inside of like you know a box and then like for it to be 25 bucks for two years for a like pretty decent size bag like I, I I truly think that that's definitely worth it That's the bag honestly if if you're looking for a fitness bag I would highly recommend hyperwear or I would highly recommend any sort of muscle boxes bags that they've provided because of their They're somewhat smaller which I like because of like you don't want to bring in you know a big old golf bag It feels like um, and then on top of that they've they've had a decent amount of room um, I'm able to bring in like my big blender bottle. I'm also, I also bring in my my weight belt. I have my fat grips. I have any sort of wrist wraps, straps. I mean, I've got pretty much every single thing in there. The only thing I don't have are my shoes, but like I don't have weightlifting shoes. So I typically bring those with me. Regardless though, even if I want to bring, like swap in with like Converse or something like that, I more than I can do that with my gray one. So this looks like just like another one of that and definitely worth 25. I don't think it's worth like a 40 to maybe even $50. I don't think that that's worth it, but for a $25 bag, 100%, you're definitely getting your money's worth. And then we've got the socks. So the socks are quoting this to be $20 for two pairs. Um, little steep there because you can find, you know, you can find New Balance for, you can probably get about six, four to six pairs for about that same amount. So let's just break it down like that. I put it for, I put it for 10 bucks, 10 bucks for, for two. I think that that's a good, good price range. So, I mean, right now we're already looking at $35, which we're already, already over, right? And then for all of this, I put it at six, um, really just for this right here, as for $3, and then $3 for these two. Overall, you're looking at a $41 box for, you know, $28 to $30. Definitely worth it, definitely worth the price. Um, you can even, you can even increase that with the bag in itself. I kind of lowballed it just because of the fact that it is kind of cheaply made. But at the same time though, like I, like I stated, that bag has helped me far beyond like the, the, the amount that it's worth. So anyway, um, if I had to rate this box, C plus to B minus, right? It's sitting at like that 79% range um, just because of again, they're doing the exact same thing that they've been doing. It seems like they just provide five different products and then they kind of put it in here, right? They focus more on the hyperware type of um, products and then they kind of give you some sort of samples for food or for snacks or for however may be. So um, yeah, that's my take on it. Anyway, I wanna know your guys' thoughts. What do you guys think about this video? Also, what do you guys think about this box? Uh, did you like it? Did you hate it? Did you feel like there was something missing? Please put it in the comments down below. Make sure you like and subscribe and thank you so much for watching.